When you're in a Zoom meeting, how often have you made somebody either a host or a co-host to enable them to share the screen with everybody? Did you know that you don't have to do that? Let me show you what I mean in today's video. Hi, I'm Michelle, a computer coach here sharing tips and tricks on your everyday software to make life just that little bit easier. So here I am in a Zoom. I've had to switch my camera off so that I can record with the camera instead. You can only have one camera uh, in use per program. So um, obviously we're all used to, if you need to, you can hover over the participants, you can click uh, the dots and you can make them either a co-host or a host. I don't recommend making them a host because then you've got to get them to share the hosting duties back with you afterwards. And actually all you need to do is to change one setting. So here at the bottom of the Zoom window we've got the uh, Zoom toolbar. I'm just going to move my screen over a little bit. And the one option that we want it to see is actually this one that says security. As you click on that you can see it opens up a menu and we've got allow participants to and there's a whole bunch of options but the very first one in that list actually says share screen. You'll notice it's unticked. So all we need to do is simply tick it, it goes away, let me reopen that for you and you can see share screen is now ticked. That is a security feature that Zoom enabled for us um, and now that it's ticked anybody in the call can actually choose to share the screen. You don't need to change any settings, it's all done for you. I hope that you found this tip useful. If you have, please do like the video. And if you'd like to be told as new videos come out, and there's one every week, remember to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell. And I will see you next time.